Hi guys, this is Varun and what I'll be doing today is a video review of Salcon A225. It's a recently launched mobile phone by Salcon. It comes with Android 4.1.1 Jelly Bean and is quite a smooth smooth performer. When you talk about the build quality the phone is pretty much thin. The body feels good from the back and it's a nice steel finish from the sides. Let me focus on it. Yes, you can see the steel finish from the sides and the thickness of the device. It's very neatly built. Although there's a small problem with the device, uh, the power button and the power lock unlock key and the volume rocker are both on the same side. Here is the power button and here is the volume up and volume down button. This can be a bit uncomfortable for some people. Although these buttons work okay, but this the positioning can be a bit uncomfortable. The power button could have been here and the volume rockers can be could have been on this side. It would have been much comfortable. Anyways, the device looks and feels good. It looks like a combination of the Galaxy S3 and the HTC device. Talking about the software, Android Jelly Bean comes pretty handy. The standard Android lock screen is very useful. The display is not that great. The viewing angles are okay. As you can see, the changes in color when you turn the device horizontal. When you see from the down downward side of the device only, the left and the right viewing angles are okay. So the software that comes pre-installed include uh, Angry Birds, Anti-Lost, Browser, Calculator, Calendar, Camera, and Documents to Go, Dropbox, Email. Although I've installed some useful apps for me, myself, but the apps that came installed uh, were my mango and file manager flashlight gallery messenger yeah and the standard android contacts phone and wi-fi settings google talk sound recorder and yup tv these were the apps that came pre-installed. All the other apps I've came, installed them myself. These are the three capacitive touch buttons that give a ha haptic feedback when you press them. This is the home key, back button and the options button. Let me show you the box package of the device. This is how the box looks like. It's written dual core 1 gigahertz on the box itself. These are the goodies mentioned in the box.
there's a 2 megapixel front camera dual sim android 4.1 that's jelly bean that's a correction that's not ICS 1 gigahertz dual core 3G bluetooth 4 gravity light and proximity sensors up to 32 GB expandable memory 21 mAh battery A225 Smartron from Cellcom Speaking about the hands free that ships with the device it's of a bad quality the ear pieces looks like this let me focus wait yeah the ear pieces looks like this and the music on this hands free is not good this is only good for making calls that's it Now speaking about the hardware, the internals of the device, let me show you the quadrant standard, the system information on the quadrant standard. You can see it's mentioned Android 4.1.1, OS version 3.4, device model name Salcon A225, the CPU, it's ARM version 7. Current frequency 1 gigahertz. Minimum is 250 megahertz. Dual cores 7 architecture. Now the display. The resolution is 480 into 854 as mentioned by Cellcon. The DPI is 240 into 240. Refresh rate is 64 hertz. Now the sensors are 3 axis accelerometer, proximity, and light this is decent considering the price point of the device I'll upload a separate benchmark video of the device also now speaking about the smoothness of the browser it's very fast and smooth I'll show you by loading up a website let's say quick info let me switch the device to landscape mode the switching is very fast you can see now let me load up ESP and quick info as I'm on a slow MTNL connection the site might load slow now I think that the mobile version has loaded up so let me quickly find the full side yeah here it is for your information I'm on a 512 kbps MTNO Wi-Fi so you can calculate the speed yourself I'll just show you the touch responsiveness and the smoothness of the browser the text is readable the website scrolls smooth the full screen mode on the browser works great zooming in is smooth and you can install flash player separately from adobe.com I have done the same to install flash player you can see I have installed the latest version of flash player to install it, you can just search Google for archived Flash Player versions. I'll show you how to do that. You can press on the mic right here and say archived Flash Player versions. It is, it is searched for NC also but it has searched correctly the first search result that you'll see is from adobe.com open it in your browser any browser of your choice 
it'll open Adobe Flash Player versions. Now what you have to do next is look for the version for Android. Yeah. Here it is. It's written Flash Player for Android 4.0 archives. These are the versions that are available for Android 4.0 and 4.1 as well. You can what you can do next is install the versions, the version that's on top. That's the latest. Android 4 and in bracket 11.1.115.47. That will solve the purpose and after you install this version, you can see Flash content in your browser itself. That's great. And as you just saw, Google now works great with the device. Other goodies like Maps, Gmail, Play Store, YouTube and Google Talk work flawless. Just to give an idea of the camera quality of the device, I've currently opened up an image, a full resolution image captured by the device. This might help you give a rough idea of how the camera on the device is. According to me, the camera is uh, good, considering the price point it's good, but it's not that great when you compare it to other smartphones from Samsung or Nokia it's not that great when, you co when compared to high-end smartphones but it performs okay it's a decent performer so this was my short overview of the Celcon A225 this might help buyers a bit if they are considering to, to buy this product. If you need anything else or you need information on some other aspect of this device you can just add in the comments section or you can follow me on Facebook or Twitter. The information for the same is mentioned in the video description. Thanks a lot for watching. This is Varun signing off.